Thomas, who lives in this marvellous house? Actually, Your Majesty, it's a haunted house. Oh, never mind then. If there's one thing I really don't like, it's ghosts. Unfortunately, someone heard King Funling say that. Tom Moss. And it gave him an idea. <laughs> <laughs> OK, King, where would you like to go today? Oh, I don't mind, really. Oh, well, uh, ah! Uh, why don't you go this way? I think there's a coal mine over there. Oh, all right. There's no coal mine over there. No, but there's a ghost behind you, and the king doesn't like ghosts. So you distracted him. Good thinking. Now I just need to get rid of it. Hey, ghost! Go away! <gasps> oh, <laughs> it's a candy ghost. Mmm. Oh, Dusty's inside. Ah, oh, Thomas, it was just a candy ghost. Phew, but if we see any more, I think we still need to keep the king away from them, just in case he thinks they're real ghosts. Yeah, we'd better keep the king away. Keep me away from what? Oh, uh, nothing. Come on. Let's go to Chatsworth Station! And off they went. But it wasn't long before... <gasps> uh oh! Uh, Your Majesty, I think the Funling would like to show you... Uh, oh, that water tower! What? Oh, uh, uh, yes, yes, come on! Very well! Quick! Gotta get rid of this ghost. Hum num 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 num. Hum num num num. Hum num num. Hmm. Minnie Mouse was inside. And then water comes out like this. Ah! Oh, so cold. Huh? Okay, let's go. Oh, Thomas, stop! Look, Chase is over there. I'd like to thank him again for saving my luggage the other day. Let me just check that the coast is clear. Uh-oh. Wait here, please. Phew. OK, Your Majesty. I don't like waiting. So while the king talked to Chase, the fun link ate the ghost. Rubble was inside. I got rid of the ghost. Nice one, Fun Ling. What a nice dog. Phew, we're almost there. And we haven't seen a single... Oh. Uh, why is there a candy ghost on the platform? Sorry, Your Majesty. When you said you didn't like ghosts, we tried really hard to make sure you didn't see any. What? Even these candy ghosts? But I love candy ghosts. Phew, really? Well, would you like to eat this one? I'd love to. Hum, 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 hum. Hum, 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 hum. Mm. Batman was inside. But we still don't know where these candy ghosts have come from. Percy arrived. Hey guys, someone's taken my candy ghosts. Have you seen them? Oh, sorry Percy. Someone was trying to spook us with them. So we kind of ate them. Oh, I wonder who did that? <laughs> What was that? Oh no, it was Tom Moss. Get him, Thomas. But Tom got away. 
Sorry guys, he got away. Oh well, and I'm sure Ghosty won't mind that you ate his candy, Ghosts. Wait, who's Ghosty? Hello everyone! Ah, a real ghost! Ah! Oh yeah, I forgot the king doesn't like ghosts. Whoopsie. <laughs> okay guys, it's time to earn your logos. Meanwhile, Percy had a very special job to do. He was delivering a valuable crown to the museum. But... Huh? What's this? Please wait here for the Percy Inspector. Percy Inspector? Ooh, that sounds quite important. <laughs> oh look, it's the Joker, wearing an expensive crown. Hold on, that's my expensive crown. He must have just made up that Percy Inspector to take my crown. Oh no, I need to get it back. OK guys, Percy has lost his crown to the Joker. We need to get it back. The Joker? Oh no, let's call Batman. There's no time, he's getting away. But don't worry, I'll stop the Joker. Caught you two! Come on, get out of the truck, Joker! Oh! <laughs> what? Oh no! I caught the Joker, but Tom's getting away with the crown! Good work, McQueen! We'll stop Tom, so you can open your logo! Dusty was inside. <laughs> OK, I've handed the Joker over to Batman, but how are we going to stop Tom? Um, slight problem, McQueen. It's not just Tom now, it's Ultron as well. But don't worry, I think I can stop them. <laughs> We make a good team, Tom. We don't need the Joker. Stop, you two! <coughs> Cruz, you can't stop us all by yourself. Ooh. <coughs> Ooh. What was that? It was Jackson Storm. Storm? I had this under control. No, you didn't. I could see that you needed help. Tom saw his opportunity and ran away with the crown. <laughs> Tom wouldn't have run away if you hadn't jumped in. Yes, but I caught Ultron for you. Guys, calm down. You both did great. You've both earned your logos. Sky was inside Storm's logo. And James was inside Cruz's logo. So what do we do now? Well, we've got another problem now. Venom's helping Tom. <laughs> I think we need to be more sneaky. Don't worry, sneaky's my middle name. Well, not really. 
I think those cars have given up. The crown is ours. <laughs> <laughs> Why have you stopped? Please wait here for the Percy Inspector. Percy Inspector? But you're not called Percy. Come on, I think it's just a distraction. Let's go. So they continued running away without realising that Mater had taken the crown back. Got it! <laughs> well done, Mater. And they didn't even notice. You have definitely earned your logo, Mater. Muddy George was inside. So Mater returned the crown to Percy, who completed the delivery. Venom and Tom eventually realised that they didn't have the crown anymore, and were very embarrassed. And the cars had definitely all learned their logos. Uh oh, that sounds like... Tom Moss? What's he up to today? <laughs> Meanwhile, Thomas had a busy day. To start with, he was delivering some coal to Superman. He loaded it into his trucks and left. But someone was following him. Soon, Thomas had to stop at a signal, and that's when Tom Moss switched the trucks. And Thomas didn't notice. <laughs> Hi Superman, I have your coal here. Uh, Thomas, that's not coal. They're rocks! What? Oh no, I must have loaded the wrong ones. I'll be back in a second. And he rushed back to where Tom Moss had put his coal. Huh, the coal is still here. I must have loaded the wrong ones. So he unloaded the rocks and loaded the coal. He was very sure that he had the coal this time. But again, he had to stop at a signal. Tom struck again. OK Superman, I definitely have your coal now. Uh, no, they're still rocks, Thomas. What? That's impossible. I definitely loaded the coal that time. Oh, but I'm running late for my next job. Don't worry, I'll get Percy to deliver your coal. Sorry. Tom had enjoyed that, so he followed Thomas again. Thomas's next job was to deliver four trucks full of parcels. But Tom got there first and added some really heavy weights to each truck. <laughs> OK, time to deliver these. <laughs> Come on! Oh. Wow, these trucks are much heavier than they look. <laughs> Come on, trucks! Ugh. Ugh. Nope. Maybe it'll be easier if I push them. So Thomas left to turn around. But while he was turning around, Tom returned and took out the heavy weights, so the trucks were very light again. <laughs> but Thomas didn't know that. Whoa! Oh 
idea. I'm sure those trucks were heavier earlier. What a day I've had so far. <laughs> it took him a while, but Thomas cleared up the mess and delivered the parcels, and at the end of the day, he headed back to his shed. On the way, he stopped at a water tower. But... It had been tampered with by Tom Moss. So no water came out of it. Ugh, oh, typical. But luckily... <laughs> oh, hi Thomas. Hi Funlings, please can you try and fix this water tower? Sure thing, Thomas. They tried fixing it, but Tom had a surprise for them. Yep, it's definitely broken. Ah, 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 oh, so cold. Oh no, I wonder why that suddenly started working. <laughs> oh, it's Tom Moss. But before they could chase him, he was gone. Sorry guys, he must have been behind all of the strange things that have happened today. Don't worry Thomas, we'll catch Tom Moss soon. So Tom ran back to his tunnel. Until next time. <laughs>
Tom uncoupled the burger. And he replaced it with fish. Yay! I'm sure the king will love this. <laughs> OK, we're back with something delicious. We hope you're hungry. You got me smelly fish. Smelly fish? What? <gasps> uh, we'll be right back again. Where did that smelly fish come from? Hey guys! Oh, hi McQueen. I just won this crown in a race, but I hear it's the king's birthday. Can you give it to him please? Yes, of course. He'll love it. Oh, thank you McQueen. But... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what? Was that Tom Moss? He must be after the crown. We need to warn Thomas and the Funlings. Do you guys mind if I stop for water? No, not at all. But make it quick. Tom took the crown and replaced it with another smelly fish. OK, let's go. <laughs> okay, Your Majesty, you'll definitely love this. McQueen got you. Another smelly fish? Where did that fish come from? Huh? Guys, Tom Moss followed you. We think he's got the crown. What? Tom Moss? Oh, that would explain everything. <laughs> Is that him over there? As Tom ran away, he dropped the crown. I'll get the crown. Thomas, follow Tom. But Tom led Thomas straight to the Burger Buster 5000 and the balloons. I can't keep up with him. But look, there's the burger and the balloons. So they took the presents back to the king, who loved them. Thank you for wanting to make my birthday special. No problem. So Tom almost got away with it today. Looks like he'll have to try harder next time. <laughs> oh, that sounds like Tom Moss. It is! Now then, recently Tom agreed to be a bit nicer. So what's he up to today? Oh, he's found a treasure map. Wait a minute. You've drawn that map yourself, haven't you, Tom? Uh-oh. That day, Thomas found the map. Ooh, a treasure map. I must follow it. So he took the map and started to follow it. Treasure, here I come. Oh no, I think Thomas has fallen for Tom's fake map prank. Right, it says I need to climb this hill. OK. Here I go. But Tom knew a shortcut to the top and had placed a huge boulder on the track. <laughs> huh? What's that? Ah! It's a boulder! Run! Phew, that was close. But that was just one part of Tom's prank. So Thomas soon made it to the top of the hill and he looked at the map again. It says I have to go through this tunnel. But Thomas didn't realise that someone was waiting for him in the tunnel. I'm coming.
covered in paint. Oh well, I must find this treasure. And he continued following the map. OK, the treasure is somewhere over there. Ooh, I see it. It's on the elevated track. I know how I can get it. And he positioned the truck underneath to catch the treasure. Yes, it fell into the truck. Ha <laughs> uh, ha. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Tom's stealing my treasure. Hey, give it back. And Thomas chased Tom. But Tom had a plan. He quickly changed the points, so Thomas went the wrong way. And the paint made his wheel slippery, so he couldn't stop. Oh, bother. Tom's prank was almost complete. <laughs> Hmm, that's strange. He's left me the treasure. So Belle soon arrived with Rocky, and Thomas was put back on the track. He was very excited to see the treasure that he'd found. But all that was inside was a smelly old fish. Oh, I can't believe I fell for Tom Moss's prank. Meanwhile, Tom had returned to his tunnel. He had agreed to be a bit nicer, but he found it a lot more fun pulling pranks like this. Uh oh. It's Tom Moss. Ooh, but Percy's seen him. Perhaps we can catch Tom out today. <laughs> so Percy followed him. Meanwhile nearby, Thomas was giving out free ice cream. Ice cream! Get your ice cream here! Ice cream! He soon had to stop at a signal. And that's when Tom switched the trucks. <laughs> and Thomas hadn't noticed. But luckily someone had. Percy. He needed to warn Thomas. Hmm, that sounds like Percy. Thomas, don't give anyone ice cream from that truck. Why not? Because Tom Moss switched the trucks. Who knows what strange flavours he's put in that one. Oh, well, don't worry. I'll go and get some fresh ice cream then. No, maybe we can switch the trucks back and give Tom a taste of his own medicine. That's a good idea. Ooh, this will be fun. So they came up with a plan. Nearby, Tom was waiting for Thomas. But he didn't realise that Thomas was behind him, switching the trucks back. Tom hadn't noticed. Yes, now to have some fun. Ice cream! Free ice cream!
he soon ran into a Funling. Oh, hi Funling, would you like some free ice cream? Yes, please. Yellow lemon ice cream, please. Coming up. But because Tom hadn't realised that the trucks had been switched back, he thought that Thomas was giving the Funling his yellow paint ice cream. But... Your ice cream is ready. Ta-da! Ooh! Mmm, that was delicious! Thanks, Thomas! No problem, Funling. Tom couldn't understand why the Funling liked the ice cream. It should have tasted like paint. Thomas then ran into Hulk. Hi, Hulk. Would you like some free ice cream? Yes, red strawberry flavour, please. Tom thought that Thomas was giving Hulk his red sombrero ice cream. But... Your ice cream is ready. Ta-da! Ooh! Mmm! <laughs> Delicious! Thanks, Thomas. Tom couldn't understand why Hulk liked that ice cream. It should have tasted like a sombrero. Finally, Thomas ran into Percy. Percy, would you like some ice cream? Yes, please. Brown chocolate ice cream, please. Tom thought that Thomas was giving Percy his brown mud and wood ice cream. But... Your ice cream is ready. Ta-da! Ooh, yum! Mm, nom, 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 Mmm, delicious! Tom couldn't understand why Percy liked that ice cream. It should have tasted like mud and wood. Tom gave up. He now wanted to taste the ice cream. So he got an ice cream out of his truck. But... He had eaten his mud ice cream. Haha, <laughs> got you Tom. We switched the trucks back, so we were giving everyone lovely ice cream, and you just ate your own strange ice cream. Tom was so embarrassed, he ran away as quickly as he could. Back to his tongue. Haha, <laughs> we got him. Your plan worked, Percy. He won't mess with us for a while. So Tom was sulking in his tunnel. Until next time. Wizard Funding, I have your cauldron. Ah, yes! I've been waiting all week for this. took my cauldron! What are we going to do? I have an idea. Looks like it's time for the Bat Engine! engine. But I'm sorry. I've lost Tom Moss. 
I don't know where he's hiding the cauldron. Hmm, I have an idea. I'm about to give you your first ever superpower. You're called the Bat Engine, so how about I give you the ability to turn into bats? Then you can find my cauldron. Oh yes, that's an excellent idea. Here we go. Whoops, that didn't work. No. It worked! All of the bats searched the island for Tom Moss and the cauldron. When suddenly, there he is. Aha! Got you, Tom Moth! Uh -oh. There's no escape this time! There you go, Wizard Funling! Now you can make the spells you've been waiting all week for! Spells? No! I need the cauldron to make soup! <laughs> hey Funlings! You look like you're in a good mood today! Yeah! We're giving everyone on the island free ice cream! Yay! Thomas, free ice cream to everyone! <laughs> However, Tom Moss was at the first signal Thomas had to wait at. Ice cream truck to a sticky tar truck. Ice cream? This is tar! That wasn't very nice, Funlings! Those Funlings can be mean! Hello! Free ice cream for everyone! Here you go! Enjoy! Huh? 
Oh, this isn't ice cream. Ugh. Do the Fondlings even know what ice cream is? Hello! Free ice cream for everyone! Here you go! Enjoy! Huh? Oh, I really, really wanted that ice cream. ice cream. Everyone on the island's going to love us. Uh, Funlings, that's not ice cream. That's tar. Oh no! We've given everyone tar, not ice cream. Quick, we must say sorry and give everyone free ice cream. Tom Moss was still at the signal. <laughs> and changed the new ice cream truck to a truck full of molten lava. <laughs> not ice cream again. That's lava. That's dangerous. Oh no! What have we done? All we wanted to do was to give out free ice cream. Oh, Funlings, it's not your fault. This sounds like a Tom Moss game. How about I ask Belle to clean up the mess then we can invite everyone here to eat the free ice cream. Yeah, that's a good idea. And soon, Belle put out all the fires and washed away the tar. Luckily, no one was hurt. The Funlings explained to everyone what had happened and everyone finally enjoyed their free ice cream. Day. 